what's up guys and welcome back to my channel i hope that you guys are doing good stop caring about what people think about you i know that it's a lot easier said than done oh trust me i know i am definitely that type of a person who has just always cared what other people think of me and i don't know why it is probably because of my insecurities about myself or low self-esteem because those things can definitely be factors to why we care so much it is just so important to some of us that people are gonna like us it's important for you to feel like people think you're pretty people think you're smart people think you're friendly people think you're a good human being but the fact is that you can't please everyone you can't. If you are in school or at a workplace, there are gonna be colleagues that you are going to maybe become friends with, but there are also gonna be colleagues that you're not gonna become friends with. And not saying that those colleagues are gonna dislike you, but you can't please everyone. There are gonna be people who just don't like you. Just accept that fact. You cannot please everyone and you are not supposed to please anyone. I think the most important thing is really to focus on the things that are important to you. Like how can you accept yourself? What do you think about yourself? And now of course it's not easy if you have a low self-esteem. It's, it's quite common that you're probably just gonna look in the mirror and be like, oh my god, I hate myself, I hate my body, I hate everything about me, I'm not smart, I'm this and that. But that's when you really just need to train your mind to think differently. You need to start thinking of yourself in a more positive way. Once again, a lot easier said than done, definitely. But you really just need to start training your brain into that because it's easy when your brain is just so used to, to all of these negative thoughts. It is so easy for your brain to just continue kind of in that path. So it takes practice, it does, but nothing is impossible. And once you trained your mind to think of yourself in a more positive way, you maybe found some things that you really like about yourself, then you're gonna start to change your view on yourself. And once you actually like yourself, once you actually like accept yourself for the person who you are, then it really doesn't matter what people are gonna think about you. If someone is not liking your hair, you're not gonna care because you're like, I like my hair, so I don't really care what you think because I like it. Or if someone is gonna tell you, oh, you're so loud. And the truth is, we can always self-improve. So let's say that you are the loudest person in the room and you are interrupting people 24 seven. It doesn't hurt to look in the mirror and recognize those things. But it's also important to acknowledge that if someone tells you, for example, that you are too loud, why do you use that time and care what that person thinks? Let him or her think that. It's a free world, so we can all express what we think. But it doesn't mean that you actually need to feel some type of way when someone says that. You just really need to stay true to yourself and you need to believe in yourself. You need to value yourself, respect yourself and just know that you are a good human being and start practicing the positive mindset. Try to start liking yourself. No one is perfect, everybody has flaws. Some people are gonna point out your flaws and that is when it's gonna feel the most because you are probably super insecure about those flaws if you acknowledge those flaws. But that's okay because we can try to think about this also in a positive manner just to kind of like oh yeah you said that i was the loudest person in the room and that i interrupt people all the time thank you for saying that i will take the time acknowledge it and i will try to become better and not interrupting people for example so you can always kind of like take that negative feedback and turn it into something positive being like okay yes i understand you feel this way and I will try to become better and then you just leave it at that. And now people who are just generally mean and don't even give you any like constructive criticism, those people you're just like, don't even listen to them. Like if someone comes to you and tells you like, oh, your clothes are so ugly. Like, what are you gonna do with that information? You can't do anything with that. So mine is just, well, take it like this, like a snowball and just toss it back. Cause like, <laughs> Well, okay, don't toss it back. I mean, we want to be the bigger person. We don't want to go down to their level and start insulting them as well. <laughs> what I meant was basically that, hear them out. If it's literally nothing important, like a thing like that, for example, 
or that I don't like your body or whatever. You are not even supposed to care, cause like, it doesn't matter what other people think. I mean, they are not the ones making you happy in this life. You don't need them. You don't. You don't need their opinions. Their opinions really don't matter. The most important thing is that you feel confident in yourself and that you feel like you like yourself. You really need to become best friends with yourself. I mean, you only have yourself until the end. And that is the truth. So why would you not like yourself? And why would you not defend yourself? When people have opinions about you, don't let them get to you. Because everybody has opinions. Doesn't mean that those opinions need to really mean anything. Just don't take them seriously. Like I said, if someone gives you really something that you can tap into, like for example, hey, I would really like for you to listen more instead of just talking over people. Okay, fine. That's something what we can work with. But things like you're just so shy all the time. Like there is nothing wrong with being shy. When people attack your personality traits, like for example, you're an introvert and people just say like, oh, but you're just always like this. Don't take it personally. I mean, even if that also hits hard and you probably think that, oh, I shouldn't be this shy and I shouldn't be this introvert and oh my goodness, I should be more social and I should do this and that because I am just a weirdo if I don't do these things. But like, just don't care because that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, honestly. It does not. If you are happy sitting on your couch all alone during the whole weekend, you go ahead and do that. You go ahead and do that because that makes you happy. That makes you a happy human being and you are living your best life instead of living a fake life and going out with people that you don't even care about, honestly. Because how can you like yourself if you are not true to yourself? Then you don't really even know who you are. But I think once you discovered who you are, and I mean who you truly are, I think you can more easily just kind of like don't care about what people say. Because if you are still insecure about who you are and you maybe have this vision of who you want to be and someone goes and insults you that doesn't fit with that person that you want to be, then it must feel horrible. Then it must feel like, yeah, there is something wrong with me. But once you accepted yourself and just kind of understood that this is the way how I am, accept it, yes or yes, then I think it's a lot easier for you to kind of not listen to other people who have a bunch of opinions about you. Just do the things what make you happy. Because like I said, the only person that you're gonna please in this life is yourself. Anyways, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like and I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, take care. Ciao ciao!